Welcome back to the World Tour of Innovation from Shanghai. We're talking about the future of microbiology testing. I'm with Dr. Mario Guerlano. He's an expert in microbiology and here in APAC, Asia Pacific, our leader for microbiology, based here in Shanghai. And today we're at the Symposium for Translational Medicine. Mario, big exciting future clearly ahead, but for today, here and now, our customers in China and really globally, uh, talk about how we're working with customers and our capabilities that we're able to bring. Probably the best example of that has been our uh, recent signing of a uh, strategic uh, cooperation agreement with KingMed. KingMed are China's largest clinical contract testing laboratory, and they are a company that we have been working with for probably 12 to 18 months now trying to deliver our full breadth of solutions to their laboratories in all aspects of clinical testing. So not just microbiology, but in immunology, clin clinical chemistry, uh, immunohistochemistry. Talk about the topic that I hear a lot, the superbug and the threats that people are worried about. You know, equally here in China, and you have any comments about that? The thing that surprised me the most uh, in terms of superbugs here has been the extreme incidence of MRSA and also multi-resistant tuberculosis. Both of those uh, are endemic in the population. Incidence rates well into the double figures um, for both organisms. Significant issues with TB in particular, not just in diagnosis but in treatment. Um, and a cultural uh, challenge here in terms of uh, infection control. That means that we as an organisation, as a company, can play an integral part in not just the identification of those organisms, but in raising clinical environmental standards to a point where hopefully we can suppress the spread of uh, those hospital acquired infections and in resistant organisms. Watch for our next progress report or see our complete lineup at thermoscientific.com.